Um, before we do anything else, there's an easel on stage because you have graced the cover of this special... Mahalakshmi can join you, yes. Aishwarya, Encha Ullar. Oh, how come you learn my two lines into this? You did not? No. Okay. But I can do this much for you. I can All learn right. ten words. Ten words in Tulu for you. Yeah. Okay. Saukia, thank you. <laughs> I, was, I didn't know she even knew one word in Tulu. Thank you. Eer Ullar, Aiki and Saukia. Injida Yan Pincha, Api Nabaki. How does that sound? Bit of it on the dot, a bit of it. I didn't get the last bit. <laughs> so you were going to tell me, I got that. Irullar, Aiki, Yansaukya. Yansaukya, 
जिंदा यान पिछो आप ही ना बाकी स्वीट स्वीट थैंक यू ओके सो शी सेड इफ यू आर फाइन आई एम फाइन अदरवाइज आई एम नॉट क्वाइट शो एट दिस मोमेंट आई एम सो टेम्प्टेड टू से यू आर गॉजियस I'm just wondering. Everybody, every day, must be saying this to you. You're beautiful, Ashwarya. You're looking beautiful. You're looking gorgeous. You're looking stunning. What do these it's, words it's really mean to you? It's a team of people who have worked in putting this together. So that kind of invites it. But thank you for your generosity. <laughs> I'm not quite sure this happens every day, but uh, professionally on professional platforms, like I always say, it's uh, uh, there's there's a team of people. who great professionals who work together to doll us up so kind of it's it's got nothing to do with me i'd like to believe this has something to do with me and i'm i'm grateful to you and the outlook group for um being so generous as to recognizing the work that we do and um thank you for the opportunity to speak to everyone through you in the interview that you so wonderfully did with me mahalakshmi and uh that means a lot because uh, i think to get to share who we are and what we do with the world at large you play a large role and you have us connected with our well wishers and that's where the voice matters because a lot can be lost in translation if if there is some kind of a lack in understanding here so thank you for um communicating with such clarity and allowing me to do the same through you and your publication Tell me, what do you do to keep looking good all the time, and keeping fit? Because I find it quite remarkable that after Aradhya, you still so look so youthful, so fresh, so girlish. Isn't it tough? Being girlish is easy. Having a lovely little girl like Aradhya in my life, that angel keeps. Uh, I think. Um, having an angel in your life keeps the child in us alive forever and i'll forever be grateful to god for uh this blessing called aradhya in my life and uh, i i don't quite attribute looks to that because that's not the way i view myself or life i mean i get it that i guess that's where it largely started and that's the way the world tends to talk about me but it's about who we are and who we become and the people that uh, we become thanks to our experiences and uh, by far the most precious experience of my life has been aradhya das far and i'll forever be grateful to god for that if you were to you have already been called the most beautiful women amongst the most beautiful women in the world if you were to rate yourself on a scale of 10 how much would you give yourself Um come on give me a number Who did the rating to begin with Sorry <laughs> Your your question began with you've been rated so I said who rated to start with Uh certainly not me Uh I don't believe in that For me as an individual or any of us sitting here uh it's a wonderful evening where so many ladies have been celebrated have been recognized and uh, kudos congratulations thank you for having me been in fine company this evening and um, i think that's what we are all about rather than uh, any kind of barometric scale not by anyone else's measure and nor our own we just need to feel good about being the best version of ourselves every waking day in our life and it's important that people in our lives or whose lives we touch feel that way and i think that's what makes uh, gives more meaning to the precious gift of our own lives just politically correct and you're being that's me i i no i'm not diplomatic i'm not diplomatic i'm not politically correct i think thank you to my parents um I've been well brought up. <laughs> Tell me who have been the most powerful influences in your life. Um well there again even if it sounds cliched I think um our our strongest influences will always be 
um, our parents, as at the risk of sounding like a cliche, but um, that's who makes us who we are. That's why we exist. That's because of whom we exist, our parents. And uh, they're the first people we are, we're exposed to. They're our teachers, our guides, and, um, and the reason we become who we do. Of course, life is the greatest teacher and um, so is experiences and everybody who touches our life thereafter. But the roots, parents, and I definitely not just know, but I believe that they are, they are and have been and will continue to be the strongest influence in my life. You've done your best in modeling, you've got the best title. You have done it in Bollywood, in movies, in films. What motivates you now? What dri drives you every day? Um, okay, in interesting because um, you can externally find reasons and attributes and I know people will be expecting me to say and a, a very strong influence today in my life is um, Aradhya. But in terms of uh, motivation, I think it just comes from uh, Something never changes in the sense that it's your basic sense of commitment to whatever you take on. And um, when that's your basics, that remains the core for the rest of your life. I don't think, I mean, that's, that's where the beginnings are and that's where the continuity uh, goes on. Um, it's all about that basic sense of ethic, integrity and commitment. And um, um, it would be wonderful and make for glorious Three, answers small, standing short here. Questions. Uh, with uh, finding other um, attributes, but it's really as simple as that. Sure. In this lifetime, you've got, you're gifted with both beauty and intelligence. In the next lifetime, if you were given only one, what would you choose? Wow, you think far ahead. <laughs> Let's get through this one. And the, the journey has been pleasant so far. And one huge learning curve, and I'm glad on it. Looking forward to what else is in store. And um, let's meet in the next lifetime and we can have a chat. <laughs> sure. Apart from you, whom would you rate as the most beautiful woman? And you can't name your mom, you can't name Aradhya. <laughs> so the enemy. Well, then let's take this occasion, like I said again, to applaud every lady sitting in this room. You all have been uh, justifiably celebrated. And yet again, thank you for having me being in your fine company this evening. Congratulations again and God bless. Thank you. Thank you so much. Beautifully said. And making day, try to be the best version of yourself. I think that's such a lovely line and that's such a lovely way to be. Big round of applause for the very beautiful, not just beautiful, but beautiful from inside as well, Eshwarya Rai. Thank you. Thank you Okay, all. Thank now I'm not going to let go of this opportunity. We have a Twitter mirror. And uh, day before yesterday, I made your father-in-law pout on stage. So now we're not going to make you pout. We're just going to make you look your lovely self. We're going to have the three of us in the picture with three of you at the back. Yes. Do I?